Hello there, my name's Ben Shires. I'm a TV presenter who you might know for things like Officially Amazing, Match of the Day Kickabout, and for having one of the best quiffs in showbiz. Anyway, for the last few years, I've worked very proudly alongside BAFTA Kids as we've travelled the UK visiting schools as part of BAFTA Kids Roadshow with the charity Place to Be. We've met some incredible teachers, Place to Be staff, and of course, some absolutely inspiring and amazing pupils. And unfortunately, it's not something that we can actually do right now because everyone has to stay at home and to stay safe. But we thought we'd still do something. So we are launching BAFTA Kids at home with Place to Be. It's a way to be creative and to use our imaginations, which are both things that are really important for our mental health and well-being. So just as an example of that today, before I started doing this broadcast, I decided to make a little sign so I could have it in the background advertise what it actually is all about. So it's got kids at BAFTA.org, which is our email. It's got the hashtag BAFTA Kids and a rather striking drawing of a BAFTA award. Uh, incidentally, the nearest that a BAFTA has ever come to being in my house. So what exactly is BAFTA Kids at Home with Place to Be? Well, we all know how films, TV and games can transport us to different worlds, can unlock our feelings and emotions and imagination and just sometimes make us laugh as well. They're absolutely brilliant and we want to celebrate that. So over the coming weeks, we're going to be speaking to some familiar faces about what they like to watch and to play. And we want you to do the same. So interact, share with your friends and family the things that you like to watch and to play games, film, TV, whatever it might be, put together a playlist and we want to know about it. So to inspire you, I thought we could kick things off with mine. Okay, up first, favourite family film and it's a biggie. Quite literally, it's got to be, for me, Lord of the Rings. In fact, if I can, I'd like to pick the whole trilogy, Extended Cut Director's Edition, unbelievable films. They're just an epic adventure. You've got hobbits, orcs, wizards. You've got a quest. You've got magic. You've got deceit. You've got honour. You've got heroes. You've got fights. It's absolutely incredible and you can really drag it out, particularly if we're all at home at the moment. You need something meaty to get your teeth into. Lord of the Rings is that meat. Next up, and it's favourite children's TV programme. And I can't help feeling I'm a little bit biased seeing as I work in kids' TV and I host shows on it. But I'm not going to pick mine, because that wouldn't be fair. Instead, I'm going to pick a show that I've been on a few times and I absolutely love. It's Blue Peter. I mean, it's a classic, isn't it? It's been going for over 60 years and it's still as relevant and important as it has ever been. It's got brilliant, inspiring things to do. It's got great presenters and they give you badges. And who doesn't love a Blue Peter badge? And what about games? Well, for me, it's got to be FIFA. I'm a self-confessed football addict. I always play as my team leads, but it's also a great one to involve friends and family, and they don't even need to be there. You can play each other remotely as well. So for me, that's got to win. So this next one is all about a film or TV character that inspires me. And for me, it's actually Dumbo, the little elephant, which I know may sound a bit weird, but hear me out. Firstly, we got something in common. Both got big sticky out ears, hello. Also, I love the message that that little guy encapsulates because when he's born, he's different. Everyone makes fun of him. He goes into himself and he doubts himself. But then actually he comes to embrace what makes him different and uses it to change people's opinions and, and open their eyes. I mean, he's an elephant who can fly, for goodness sake. And as someone who's maybe felt on the fringes of society sometimes and, and, and doubted themselves, it really made me feel like I had a connection with him. And I love that little elephant. Okay, this next one is a biggie, my all-time family recommendation. It's a classic film, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, based, of course, on the Roald Dahl book, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Roald Dahl was, in fact, involved in making the film, hated it when it was released. But I don't know why, because... It really is a world of pure imagination. Gene Wilder as Willy Wonka is amazing. He darts about in that massive hat, the, the purple livery, that feeling of him being magical and mystical, but full of malice as well. The Oompa Loompas, the songs, the rivers of chocolate. Oh, actually it's making me kind of peckish. Well, they were some of my favourites, but we can't wait to hear from you too. Just email kids at BAFTA.org and tell us what your favourite things are to watch and play and why. And we could be using yours on social media. You never know, you might even get a shout out from a famous face. And in the meantime, why not use this time to watch, share and enjoy things like films, games and TV shows with the family and friends that are around you. And if you don't have those special people 
all in one place. Perhaps you could do things remotely, agree to watch something and then talk about it afterwards. You never know, you could even introduce your nan to FIFA. Whatever it is, I really hope that you enjoy it. Please do stay safe, look after each other and we'll catch you again soon. Bye.